Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the latest class of Stratflow classes. Well, in the last class, we have already learned about how to do a translational repeat, how to add these cursors, uh, I mean selecting of the translational repeat and all, in various directions, in Y, in Z, in X, very good. Fine, so now we have already have, we already have this structure uh, stretched in Y direction uh, and 1, 2, 3, yeah, G plus 3 building. So now the thing is that uh, we want to see its side view, top view and all. For seeing the view we have different tools here. On this toolbar just you see there are various squares, uh, mainly cubes with different faces written. So just see if I click on this one this is the front view. Just see front view yeah. Till now we have already switched on, on the, the nodes are displaying the numbers. In order to switch that off press shift plus n it just disappears the node number just disappears okay fine so now this is the front view this is the back view this is the side view actually all our views are same because uh, this is a symmetrical one this is a top view this is the bottom view and this one is the isometric view that we are seeing it and now just see when your structure you have just doing something on over, over this one then uh, you have just zoomed out in order to view the whole structure just click on this place this button so the whole structure comes into picture now just think about it uh, I am having this 2 by 2 room here and I want to do something on this floor on this floor maybe add one or more room maybe add one or more node then how to do it I need to go at that level so for that one I note uh, means there is an option given in stat pro that cut section I can cut out this section and work on that place I can just cut out the whole section and work over that place so for that one uh, first we uh, need to display the node number by clicking on shift plus n well shift plus b gives you the beam number too just say shift plus b gives you the uh, beam number and shift plus b also does out of the beam number so just shift plus n and we are up with the nodes fine then go for the cut section uh, we have to select an xz plane with node number say this uh, plane we were considering the node number is 19 ok just see, I have just selected the plane. Anything I want to do here, maybe I want to delete this beam, I can delete it down. Okay, just see, I have just deleted it without the whole structure. And now, uh, if I want to display the whole structure, just click on this one. I have got the whole structure. Now, if I want to select this plane, the front plane, the whole front plane, that is in the YZ, then go for this cut section, the YZ plane, with node number, say 28 okay the see I've selected so in this way we can proceed so hope to see you in the next class thank you